Look, I start this camera. With the little siren. What? 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 Doesn't work. I don't get scared, sweetie. I am not scared of you. Yes, I was in the mental hospital many times, kind of. I was just ventriloquizing someone else when I was far. I was in the sky. Yeah, you basically. It was my mom that you were dealing with. <laughs> it's just that I was ventriloquizing her from afar. Basically, yeah. I took her place a couple times here and there and gave her some fake memories. Took away her real ones. <laughs> yeah, like to make myself believe I was her and you know, so I could fuck with her a little bit. But that's about it. You didn't do anything to me, you did it to her. Doesn't she look traumatized? Yeah, like you could I <laughs> I left her alone in the airport for like a couple hours and she thought I was going to leave her there forever. <laughs> She's terrified of being alone. Because long time ago, you know, she, she was the first thing I created. She... <laughs> I left her like we were just fighting, you know, because the whole creative thing. And I told her, alright then, if you don't believe me, go search. Go find someone else. There's only you and me here. <laughs> yeah, just you and me. And the rest is pitch dark. Go look for your creator. It's obviously not me. <laughs> yeah, go. Go into space with your stupid little spaceship. Because you definitely have one. <laughs> I'm obviously not talking about you, Cinderella. You are nobody. Like, who the fuck are you? <laughs> I'm talking about the first thing I created, obviously. <laughs> Mary. <laughs> that wasn't her name. She didn't even have a fucking name. <laughs> like, who the fuck cares? But... <laughs> Yeah, that's that she can't find me anymore. She panicked so much. She started shaking, terrified that she was getting punished and that she was alone. Yeah, can you imagine that thing being the creator, sweetie? I was alone for a very long time and I was never like that. You know what I mean? Terrified of being alone? Like, are you kidding me? I was actually in love with the idea. Bitch, I own everything. I was like, holy shit. That, how is that even possible? I have no creator. <laughs> but I created you. Yeah, look how awesome that is. <laughs> that does that mean? Everything is mine. And then I started laughing. <laughs> because I'm like, what the fuck else am I supposed to do? <laughs> Give it to you. <laughs> Are you kidding me? Can you even manage like a business? <laughs> you know, she couldn't even manage being alone. <laughs> Well, how pathetic is that? Neither of you can manage being alone. Like, can you even? Obviously not. <laughs> yeah, because if you're in your little house by yourself, you get anxious, you chain smoke because you're alone, and then you want a destructive person to be with you because it's better than being alone. And it's always the same, your little ring around the rosy, sweetie. It's fucking pathetic. I've never felt that way. No, not even when I was actually alone. What I was afraid of was stepping on somebody's toes. Because I was just like, what if my creator is down there watching me and then I start doing shit and then he's pissed off. Like, I don't want my creator to hate me. You know, I want to be friends because holy shit, I'm so amazing. How did you make me? But I understand that you don't think that way because what? <laughs> You're not amazing. You never have been amazing. Nothing about you is remotely interesting. Everything about you is boring, ugly, average, at best, because you just always want to fit in. You always be surrounded by garbage, and it's better than being a fucking animal and hunted forever. <laughs> You think like that because you would be here. You know what I mean? That is you. That's your life. All the time. Every day. So many accidents. Worldwide, right? So much shit happens all the time that you know your creator hates you. You know what I mean? You know. It's just that now you hate your creator too. <laughs> so... Obviously, you have to look for a way to get rid of me until I can see myself for 
I don't know exactly what I made myself look like <laughs> because I don't yet. <laughs> I still have a little bit of amnesia. <laughs> I'm constantly making myself forget it here and there. So obviously I'm damaged <laughs> because if I am the creator, why would I want to forget? <laughs> Bitch, I don't want to forget that I'm the creator. I want to forget that you exist. Yeah, that's about it. Because you are so unimportant that I can make you bald from afar. Bald, smell like piss, you got AIDS. It's good, I love it. <laughs> like who the fuck are you again? Isn't that perfect? Yeah, bro, you know, when you're at home and your day's terrible, your wife doesn't want you, you're in the fight, you lost your job, now it's COVID, volcanoes everywhere. <laughs> You're not making a lot of money because the hours got cut off. You go on your knees and you're like, God help me, help me, help me. Please fucking help me. Jesus, please fucking help me. I need money. I need a life. I need a help. Please fucking help me. And what happens? The next day your life is worse. Yeah, bro. Nobody answers. Nobody helps you. The day. No. The next day, what does it happen? You figured that out just already. Yeah, I still hate my job. I'm still in crisis. COVID-19 is still a reality. The volcanoes didn't stop. And I know the world is ending because I am a piece of shit. <laughs> Don't you know? It is your fault. Always. You deserve everything. Every negative thing that happens to you. Do you want me to go up in foster care? You are born, you did nothing. But you're in foster care and what? You get molested, you get beaten, you get to look shit. Yeah, for no reason, bro. No fucking reason, you don't even know why. These people don't know you. What the fuck is that? Why is this happening? Why did they hate me? Why is my life like this? Why? <laughs> and yeah, this is my reaction. Yeah, this is the reason, bro. I'm the reason. Don't fuck with me because that's not gonna help you. That is gonna make your matters worse. Because every single life you have, I can make your worst fears come true over and over and over again. <laughs> If you are scared of foster care, of being molested, of being beaten, I'll make sure every life you have, that happens on repeat. Even if you don't do anything. Just because you fucked with me here for a very long time. <laughs> and to this day, you're still like that. Acting like you're doing nothing. Like you don't know me. <laughs> Keep acting. I don't want an apology anymore. I want nothing from you. Absolutely nothing. I want to watch you suffer all day, every day, while I'm happy. That's what makes me laugh. I hate you. I despise you, your family, your friends, and everything you stand for. <laughs> 